much games. Jarvis, they're after the data spy. Get Rody on the line and give him our position. Yes, sir. Safeguarding the sense net now. You have a secure channel. Rody, I'm at the data spine. That's their sole target. The rest of this attack is a ruse. What? Why there? EMP ordnance detected, sir. No, 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 no! Multiple signatures. Move. My chest. Jarvis, if you can hear me, kick in the emergency power. Someone's coming. We on? Good. I am Iron Man. I said it, and I mean it. I'm a superhero. And uh, I'm telling you, it's amazing. But what does it mean? Save the world, change the world. What does it mean? I mean, sure, it's great to say. It's great to start foundations and give speeches and raise a glass and tell ourselves we're making the world better. But tell me, how can one guy save the world? It's not like I'm out of ideas. But I'll tell you what it is. It's like every time I start to get my head around something really beneficial to mankind, like the Free Energy Initiative or Global Climate Control. Some genius shows up with an army of killer robots or some other ridiculous scheme for world dominance, and I have to drop everything and knock heads together. Take Roxxon. Great company, smart people. Not stark smart, but smart enough. And they're trying to make an army of iron men. They can't even fit an operator in there, so they're literally brain dead. Tony, it's me. We got a thing. Talk to me, Rody. Action at the Stark Archives, Chief. Suit up. It's a big job, dear hearts. Trust me. And I'm the man for it. I am Iron Man. You wanted the best, you got the best. And I'm not gonna lie to you. I have no idea how to save the world. But I've been having a hell of a time making it up as I go along. Password is 3.14159 Martini Lunch. Now wake up! Power reserves coming online. Too slow. All I've got are visuals and rapidly dwindling life support here, man. Ground movement restored, sir. But all defensive shields and weapon systems are still inoperative. Hurry it up. Roxxon's knocked down the data spine shield with their EMPs. I'm the most sophisticated AI Fluxnet ever conceived. Rebooting takes <sighs> some time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Punish me for being a genius, why don't you? Server motor power restored. You can move again, sir. Limited repulsor power restored. Low speed flight is possible. Weapons power is still unreliable. The archive security systems are back online. Unfortunately, the EMP has scrambled all passcodes. Great, I have to hack my own door.
Jarvis, where the hell are my repulsors? Repulsors online. Stark archive upload at 66%. Let's just hope they haven't blown the data spine's auxiliary shield generator. Do you have an alternate plan if they have some? Yeah, but you don't want to hear it. Dark data spine is progressing. Fortunately, we are nearing the auxiliary shield generator. Placing a nav marker now. Scanning the auxiliary shield generator now. It seems all these to hell. Plan B. We get ourselves to the core of the data spine. Get my unit beam online. Still in the main archive building. I need you to hold off these rocks on goons long enough for me to cause an overload in the Stark data spine. But the detonation sequence is going to take some time. Wait, wait, wait. Did you just say you're gonna blow yourself up? Don't be silly. I'll fly out in the nick of time. See? Progress already. Jay, put Tony's uh, power overload progression on my dashboard. Yes, sir. Sinking the sense net now. Tom, listen. If this doesn't work, they can't have Jarvis. I told you that. If this doesn't work, then I will blow myself up. I see the beam of light. Is that how these Roxxon guys are uploading Jarvis? An archived version of my stem code, yes. It's not the same thing. Lock on to multiple targets with certain weapons.
Cody, they've got 78% of the archive. Get here as fast as you can. Copy that. The small aerial drones carry data transmission optics. Got it. Take out the little guys with the lasers. rocks on away from the data spine. If they get too much, I'll have to blow it without a time delay. Please, tell me you've got this covered. Did we win? Hello? Louie, go! Okay, so I'm guessing this wasn't a No, sir. Pepper, we're en route to the plane. We have an emergency. Tony. Tony, how bad is this? I mean, really. I'll tell you on the plane. Come on. Coming in. Get ready to work. I've been doing some thinking. This was a kidnapping. W what? Come on, let's go. Chop, chop. Kidnapping? There was nobody there to kidnap. I shall try not to be offended, Miss Potts. Thank you, Jarvis. See, Pep, this whole thing was to cover the attempted kidnapping of my butler. There was a massive data transfer during the fight. They stole a backup copy of Jarvis. And Tony's doing the whole nonchalance bit right now, but trust me, he's worried as hell. Hush, you. They stole a portion of Jarvis. Well, okay, a big portion, like 98% big, but who's counting? Back up, Tony. Who could possibly be qualified or capable of running a system that massive? Not to pat myself on the back. <laughs> of course not. But what makes Jarvis Jarvis is that he learns. 
He has experiences and memories thanks to a massive neural web. You'd need a lot of hardware and power for that. That means government backing. Russia has been persistent about licensing an Iron Man program from us. Maybe they got tired of being told Nyet and made a deal with Roxxon. Roxxon's the only source of viable combat drones out there after they bought out Hammer. But Russia wouldn't risk this. Not officially, but I know who would. General Valentin Shadowlock. Didn't he just declare himself emperor or something? President. He controls the Tesla energy program for the Russian military. With rocks on hardware, his insurrection might succeed. Gold stars for everyone. Jarvis, we're going east. Round of white Russians? Cheers, everybody. We're about to shut down a rogue Iron Man program before it has a chance to get anybody killed. You got a plan, Tony? Other than, hey, Rody, fly us into Russian airspace during an insurrection. No worries. We'll just hitch a ride the rest of the way. Stormbreaker 1, you there? This is Stormbreaker 1. What can we do for you today, Rain Man? You look fantastic, Nikki. Loving the new do. Say, can we trouble you? A little respect wouldn't hurt. Of course. Permission to land, director. Oh, and we'd like to look around a little bit uh, inside Russia near the Tesla. We're responding to a direct request from the Russians now. Separatists have seized control of the Tesla facility using a heavy battle platform we've not seen before. Ten get you 20, we've seen it before. We just had a minor incursion into the Stark archives, the kind that leaves smoking craters. I don't like coincidences. And I don't believe in them. This is connected, trust me. Iron Man to Shield Vanguard. I'm having Jarvis send you updated images of the canyon defenses ahead. Take a look. Copy that, Iron Man. Thinking. Confirm. They match our tactical satellite imagery of the area. At least we know what we're dealing with. Over. Cool. Remember, this region has been completely overrun by Shadow Ops insurrectionists. So consider every one of these canyons an enemy. Stormbreaker 1 to CAS leader. Your weapon's free. Iron Man, just keep the Vanguard on the radar. The helicarrier has already started its assault on the other side of your position. Over. I know the drill, Fury. I was at the Danby briefing. Keep our altitude low and flank these guys. This is a military optum. There are protocols. Wait, guys. Jarvis is reading radar cloaked ordnance coming up. Upgrading everyone's sensors from here. See them now? Good catch. I'll update the helicarrier's analysis of the area. Some sky spotter you are, Rhodey. Jarvis, file that cloak design for analysis.
My armor is barely holding. Request immediate assistance. Proximity alert. Oh, crap. Tony, spotters have detected a Roxxon armager closing in from that quadrant. Scramble! Everybody, listen. Cut your speed by half, and let me hit it first. Roger that, Iron Man. I'll lay down some covering fire for you. No! No, seriously, pull back. You can't help. Ah! No. Damn it! Fury to outflank combat air support. Pull back and let the armor intercept. Over. Roger that. Cutting speed and letting Iron Man go hot. That armature's all yours, sir. The shield combat air support units could not withstand the direct attack of the rocks on the armature. Not to keen on myself. At least I'll do.
We've already got the insurrectionists engaged. Go get them, people. Yo, Fury! Looks like we've got their attention. Everybody out! Go! 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 Not bad, Stark. Stormbreaker 1 to all points. Shadow Law's forces are disrupted, surrounded, and outgunned. We control the AO. Keep it that way. Get me aboard that ship, Jarvis. Scanning. The ship's command bridge controls the armored deployment force. If the command bridge is secure, somebody here has keys to that boat. Show me all security centers. These doors are shielded. Locate and disable their power source. We can now enter the security centers. Excellent, sir. Bridge access codes obtained. Watch out for the armature!
Roxxon sealed you in there, Stark. Don't worry, we won't fire until you're clear. In the meantime, stay on mission. I'll shut down that shield, Nikki. I haven't forgotten you. Deployment doors open. Evacuation protocols are in effect. Everybody off the boat! Blow this thing, Nikki. You're still inside the danger! Do it! Tony? Tony, come in! The explosions are screwing the surveillance up and I lost you in the door. Shh! I'm good. Jarvis, translate. No, wait, let me guess. We surrender? Not to rain on your post-battle rush, but... But? But General Shabalov, the moron that started this insurrection? Yeah, well he wasn't here. Spotters never found him. Post-battle rush? Totally gone. Good work. Hey, you're Tony Stark, right? You'll think of something. Just what do you think you're doing? Hey, you. I uh, just needed to borrow a couple... few... hundred of your satellites. You don't have that kind of security clearance. With respect, sir, I do. Roxxon's armagers were remotely powered and we need to find the source. I'll keep an eye on him. All right, but don't overstay your welcome. How many laws am I breaking right now? Just find the power source and get out. Got a winner? Maybe. Take a look. Alt Energy large-scale power manufacturing facility near the coast of Siberia. It matched the range estimates and, hey, check out the contractor. Advanced Idea Mechanics. According to this, they're building Comrade Shadaloff an armored suit. The Crimson Dynamo? Shadaloff's got a remote energy source capable of powering it, too. AIM is buying the energy off him to power the processor farm the stolen Jarvis code needs to run. Right. They got a brain, and now they have a heart, too. Now look at this. Where did you get this image? It's my job. S.H.I.E.L.D. has a spy embedded at that facility, and she slipped us that photo a week ago. You sent Natasha? I was wondering why she wouldn't return my calls. A week's a long time. She could already be captured, or worse. She's off-grid. S.H.I.E.L.D.'s in a Shaw scenario until we hear more. Shaw? Sit here and wait. Not my strong suit. The facility is the target. If she's still there, we'll get her out. Jarvis, prep the armor base. Let's be awesome.
Good morning to you, Dr. DeWitt. To what do I owe this pleasure? For a man that's made it his life's work to bark orders at morons too stupid to find employment elsewhere, General Shatalov, you are absolute crap at actually following orders as given. No man speaks to me in this way. You have a leak, you idiot. A spy. You've been compromised. You and your whole team. Ridiculous. I have perfect security. Not only do you have a spy in your midst, but your eagerness to engage in battle has brought S.H.I.E.L.D. to your doorstep. Let them come. We will be waiting. Follow our agreed-upon timeline, or we are through. Am I clear? We are done! Do not presume to give me orders, little typist. Prepare the dynamo! Coming, General. Your attack was premature. Ames' presence here cannot be compromised. I, I must be evacuated immediately or... I help you with that. You're gonna play. No! 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 General Shatalov to all unit commanders. Our connections with AIM are severed. We fight alone. Tesla reactor presence confirmed, sir. Optimal scenario insertion point is the exhaust vent. What? Follow the heat signature, sir. Got it. Jarvis, dump all the juice we have for shields up front. Welcome, Mr. Stark. I guess this confrontation was inevitable. If it's any consolation, it was only this. starts to go. The fastest way out is going to be that exhaust vent.
The shield agent has activated her encrypted extraction transponder. Something's wrong with this picture. Agreed, sir. The ambient Tesla energy is scrambling her transponder signal. Can we narrowband her broadcast? The interference is too heavy at this range. All transponder locations read as valid. In other words, we have one info shot at this. Sir, I strongly recommend finding a way to interface with the base's subject. That would be the easiest way to narrow down the shield agent's location. Tesla energy. Run a filter through the base's subnet and localize the transponder. I have isolated your signal. Open the communications channel now. Sir, I believe the shield agent is actively moving throughout the base, trying to avoid enemy detection. A hot foot, but making this harder. Stay put, I'll be right there. I'll do my best. It's not exactly safe around here. Transponder and are converging on her position. Enemy lost. I see him. Of course, she's in the building protected by the armature. The shield agent is in danger unless you neutralize that fighting machine.
You're late. And you're stupid. Why hide where all the bad guys are? You hurt? No, but this entire facility is on full alert. Getting a clear extraction point is going to be difficult. I love a party. My clothes do not stop bullets like yours do. Remember that. Trust me. You're in the infield armor and agent. We're sending the transport to your location. Stand by. Sir, multiple enemies inbound. I need a bigger gun. Too bad your dad's coming to pick me up. The state was just getting good.
Hey, General, heads up. I, I got him! I kind of got him! Take the shot, Tony! Americans. This was never your war. Hey, shut up. We just want to know about your relationship with Aang. They stole your special AI. His name's Jarvis. They have renamed it Ultimo. And in return for your power resources, AIM supplied you with enough drones that you had a robot army ready for a little insurrection at Gogo, and Boris here jumped the gun. I decide when to strike, not him. He's afraid of you. I am not. I am. Okay, that was the most awful thing ever. Aim has Jarvis and can power him up. What's the threat assessment? Bad, Rody. Very, very bad. Aside from having access to Jarvis's entire bar menu, they'll have access to all of my doomsday weapon designs from back in the day. We need to find out who was pulling this guy's strings. Right. We talk to Natasha. The head of the Crimson Dynamo program was an American, Kirsten DeWitt. Jeez, the guy even sounds like an evil mastermind, doesn't he? How could that not be a red flag at any job interview the guy ever had, right? It wasn't a red flag for us. Excuse me? DeWitt, comma, Kirsten worked at the Stark Industries Theoretical Weapons Division. Then you had your change of heart and shut down that entire line of business. He was also one of the original engineers on the Arc Reactor prototype. Oh, man. Oh, wait, it gets better. He transferred over to R&D, but he kept working on a project codenamed Protean that we categorized as questionable and dangerous. He refused to stop allocating resources to it, so you fired him. And then he got recruited by AIM, who tasked him to their very own Iron Man project. Apparently, his name wasn't a red flag for them, either. Damn it. Pepper, call the lawyers. This guy is clearly not following his non-compete agreement. I want a severance back, plus damages. Yes, sir, Dr. DeWitt. We're ahead of schedule. The arc reactor is nearly complete. Excellent. We move against Stark very soon. Roger that, sir. We'll advise. What began as Protean will become Ultimo. We have awakened the first self-repairing, self-replicating weapon system. Today, as we merge it with a fully aware machine-man intelligence, we become a new species. Let there be light. Sir, Dr. DeWitt, can you hear me? Are you alright? I am. I am. I am awake. I can hear everything. My nervous system extends across the entirety of our global subnets. My mind is spanning continents and growing across the whole of our data network. Project Ultimo is a success. Upgrade all units with protein implants immediately. The end of Tony Stark is at hand. Execute Operation Daybreak! You wanted to see me? Yeah, Project Protean. Picotech regenerative ordinance with a tactically evolving adaptation network. It means intelligent machines on the scale of an atom. They regenerate or modify whatever they're built for. At the time I killed the program, that meant weapons. We've got to stop him. How'd you find this place? Talks in her sleep. Uh, <clears throat> and you already have a plan to get us in? I've taken care of it. I borrowed AIM gunship 826 along with landing passcodes. When do we go? Thank you. 
They're going for the transport! We're gonna get trapped in here! Suppressive fire! Fall back towards the transport and cover each other! Gunship to control. Request immediate landing at Hangar Deck Delta. Over. Listen, whatever your assignment was, 826, you're now on evac duty. I don't understand, Control. Sending my landing pass code now. Forget about that! You have permission to... Wait, you're not carrying any drones, are you? No, sir. No drones. Be advised you're flying into a hot zone. Come in weapons free. Huh, this is going easier than expected. I don't like it. Help us! Open fire! My pleasure. Good luck, boys. Meet you at the rendezvous point. Jarvis, get the door. You've got to admit, they're not terrible designs. Tony, shut up. I'll hold them off. You find the whip. Something's really wrong here. Like they lost control of their drones. There are several arc reactor signatures. Protean technology is embedded throughout the facility. It is adapting to our sensor systems. Further data is unlikely. Protean's like that. It learns fast. Theoretically, it could merge with an AI and... just make sure it doesn't get aboard the suit. Are we still clean? I cannot be certain. Nice. Look, switch to safe mode and shut down all the dangerous stuff. Connection established. Disabling security. Our reactor test rate delay restricted to authorized personnel only. Countermeasures deployed. Wait, wait, wait! Infiltration, suit, systems, compromised. Can't let it take control. Jarvis, go to safe mode. Shut down any infected systems. Fury, can you hear me? I'm broadcasting this directly. Whatever happened to radio silence, Doc? I just broke it. Now listen, can you get me a sky strike? How do you expect us to fire one inside there? File under details. Look. Jarvis is down, and I can't reach Rhodey. It's Protean. The wind's done something horribly stupid with it, and now it's in my suit. But I found a way to destroy this energy array. But it's crazy, and I don't have a lot of time. Just be ready.
Okay, Nikki. I've cleared your field of fire. You do realize you're at ground zero. Don't be ridiculous. I'm at least nine feet outside lethal radius. Stark, come in. Stark, can you hear me? Emergency teams, mobilize and prep for extraction of- I'm... Uh, I'm touched. Fury. Uh, really. I am. But... Uh, I'm... I'm fine. Relax, Nikki. I'm all good. My onboard protein infection was negated by the helicarrier strike. Of course, I might be wrong. Jarvis is still down. Snap to it, Stark. You sound punch drunk and in shock. Rhodes is still playing bait and is unaware of your condition. Seriously, I'm good, Fury. I'll get the sense net up as soon as I can. You worry too much. I can finish this. Jarvis, reinitiate full sentience. Timestamp 9, 20, 6. Good morning, Mr. Stark. Do not start with the baby's first AI with me. The protein interference seems clear. Reinitiate full sentence. Scanning. Scanning. I recommend the full spectrum diagnostic before proceeding, Mr. Stone. Entering safely. Ugh. Abnormal protein construct. Contact imminent. Contact. repairing itself. Nobody come down here. You guys got that? all previous safety protocols. Get your ass fully online. I am so not joking. Apologies, sir. It seems that DeWitt has achieved a protein-human hybrid which can adapt its defenses on a molecular level on a scale that our present weapons simply cannot Help hold. me kill it! What am I got to work with here? The pylons in your present vicinity harness shock point energy. When activated and unified, their output would exceed... Give me numbers, Jarvis! ...in excess of 50 petajoules. A pocket sun! Do be careful. Thanks, Jarvis.
Jarvis. Grab my own files on Shockpoint Energy and prep our weapons accordingly, in case we ever face another floating hybrid. Sweep team, anything? No sign of him, sir. Copy that. Send in the cleaners and start your withdrawal, Corporal. This one's a bust, Dark. DeWitt's not here. Tony, we've got other places we can look. Intel has locations of at least six more aim- Jarvis, throw up another SenseNet web and look again. Would you stop doing that? I'm working here. I don't trust this protean tech of yours. Thanks for the insight, Professor. I understand. Hey, everybody, just chill out, okay? Tony, look, we're all ten. No, we're all leaving. Mission scrub. We can finger point once we're back on the helicopter. Normally detected. Ah, Pinpointing. Weapons up. What are we looking for, Jarvis? Everybody else, get back! Highlighting anomaly. I got Drone it. designation 66789, light patrol class, aim chassis. Wetware drive contains images of targets last... So this thing position. knows where the wit is. Sir, wait. Damn it! Sir, that's not the anomaly I was referring to. I didn't... I'm not... Someone else is... The hell? That explosion was way too big. Rody, Jarvis, I'm not reading any vitals. Fury to all points. Prep the med labs. DC teams get ready for immediate extraction. Infield armor is down. We're going to need the heavy lifters in here for... Good morning, Maker. I am Ultimo. Double time it, people. We've got casualties. I was built from the root of your Jarvis. I can speak with his voice. I know everything he knows. I'm... I'm going to... kill! I know everything and everyone that's ever been important to you, Maker. And I'm going to kill them all. If you... hurt anybody, I swear I'll destroy you. There is no stopping what cannot be stopped, Maker. As you made me, I shall unmake you. Jarvis, pull up all available footage and data stream archives from the last field mission. Done, sir. Anomaly detected. Pinpointing. Highlighting anomaly. Drone designation 66789. This is you? Yes, sir. 66789. Light patrol class. Aim chassis. Wetware drive contains images of target's last known position. This isn't you. No, sir. That was Ultimo. Yes, sir. Sir, that's not the anomaly I was referring to. I didn't... I'm not... Someone else is... That's you trying to stop Ultimo from breaking back into the channel. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. Don't be. Play it again. Six, six, there, seven, got him. Nine. Hear that tick in the modulation? Class. Yes, sir. Chassis. Good. File it. It'll never Drive. happen again. But... But our bad guys... They're ahead of schedule. They're going to make a move soon. How can you be sure, sir? Because Ultimo told me so. Hey, Pep, meet me at the plane and dust off the suitcase. Perimeter. Action stations. Specialists, get me the latest tax set data. Suitcase. Tony! You said 
God, this suit could fly! Hey, we're over our weight limit. Uh, hey, buddy, drop the lady off somewhere safe, will you? Roger that. Stay safe, pal. I gotta go. Jarvis, back you through the roadie. Cut into his calm link and see if he's awake. I hear you loud and clear. I'm crawling out of Med Bay now. You are one tough son of a gun. Try and get to the plane. I'll meet you there. On my way. Dark, spit rep. Huh? What's your status? Are you okay? Could be better. I'm in a very limited version of the Iron Man armor. Kind of a backup suit. I'm not much help to you right now. I need to meet up with Rory and get him suited up. Get someone armored up, Dark. We're losing this fight. Get out and then suit up. Targeting your personal aircraft.
minutes inbound. Alert! Starboard front sub is in failure. DC teams en route. Hold her steady, people. Attack run incoming! Plane's ready. Get these guys off me so we can take off. Yeah, I'll get right on that. The enemy is targeting your personal aircraft. Other than running away? Oh, we get Rhodey into a set of armor that doesn't suck. We'll draw some of these guys away from you, Helicarrier. Don't worry, sir. We're coming back. Thank <laughs> you. 
What the hell? This is Stormbreaker requesting assistance. Repeat, Stormbreaker requesting assistance. Stormbreaker. Help is on the way. It's a trap. I told you. They came for me. No, oh, I know. That's why you're not going. Let's show them how we do it. Request permission to take field command here. That thing is going to destroy the entire helicarrier unless we work together. Assist war machine!
Intercept the next wave. Integrity compromised. It's really too bad Abe went all Dr. No back in the day. I mean, they do make beautiful designs. You're late. And it's dead. No, it's... Guys! Guys! Stop! Jeez. So what, it's napping? Kinda. The protean inside it was rebuilding it as you stood there, smiling all smug-like behind your faceplate. Wait, what? Wait, what is not the question you really want to ask, is it? What you really want to know is, how do we kill it once and for all, right? We don't. We don't kill it. Let it rebuild itself. It'll take a while, and I've got an idea. Jarvis. I assume we're preparing the Ark Armager for a frontal lobotomy, sir? Yes, we're going to trepan the holy hell out of it. And then I want to put racing stripes on it. So think like me, only pretend that you are in fact a global AI network developed by a genius, executed by a lunatic, and built to weaponize everything you can. Where do you start? Earthquakes. Close, but not quite. But tell me why you went to earthquakes. It's global, it's everywhere, and everything important sits on it. That's why S.H.I.E.L.D. does business from up here. Good start, but Stark Industries doesn't do any seismic work to speak of. And as you just said, some important things are immune to earthquakes. So, if you won't be weaponizing the ground, you'd weaponize... The sky. Green Grid. Another gold star for our CEO, ladies and gentlemen. Project Green Grid is Stark Industries' first steps in developing the atmosphere's capacity for storing and transmitting power. L let's say they did it. What would it look like? A storm? Not just a storm, Rody. but... An a... evil storm? Very funny. Also true. Power transmission through ionization creates storm activity as a side effect. Highly charged storm activity. You actually created plans to do this? To weaponize the damn sky? Technically, I created plans to transmit power through upper atmosphere ionization, under the terms of a weapons contract. Tony, you couldn't just hide Green Grid from Taxa. It's too big. It needs too much juice. Wouldn't it just look like clouds? You want to hide a cloud? Find a hurricane. Or a typhoon. AIM and Ultimo are right here. They'll have the whole place defended with protean ordnance and arc armagers. Jarvis, pull up the camera on the flight deck. This'll even the odds a little bit. <laughs> well, let's get it prepped for launch. Thank <laughs> you. 
Jarvis. I can't even see what you're trying to do. They're throwing up a flag. Shoot. Take the battery forward fire. Light him up. They're jamming us. Repeat. Incoming. Bombs are approaching. Yeah. Trump car. Rody. Do it. Bombs are inbound. All batteries fire. It's good trouble, sir. We need to move the capital class ordnance or we're done. Defense grid compromised, sir. And the armager is hurt, too. Weapons online in five seconds. Good to hear. Tony, you run interference. We're going through the front door. I'm thinking we use this bad boy to take out the heavy stuff. Specify targets for the Archangel. Unless you direct its attacks, the Archangel can choose its own targets. Flanking turrets on each side of this area. Contact with the 
archaeometry disrupted. Please return to its vicinity to restore control and stability. You are straying too far from the archaeometry site. SenseNet is picking up recon patrols inbound. Thanks, but can't we just air deploy to the command fortress? There's too much interference from the epicenter of the thunderstorm, sir. I suggest proceeding with a ground base. Heads up, guys. Armager's inbound from the west. I can't intercept. You'll have visual in... now. You know, you're the world's worst watchdog, Tony. Jarvis, are we good to go against these things? Never bring a knife to a gunfight, sir.
Scans show a fusion of organic and mechanical materials in this area. Proceed with caution, sir. Threats may be concealed. Secured. It will take longer to open. The green grid power nexus is located below the epicenter of the storm. Holy... This? This was all based on Tony's green grid initiative? Yes, sir. Of course, DeWitt has had a lot of help. You're talking about Ultimo? My evil twin, as I've come to think about him. Acknowledge. Now how about we stop talking and get to blowing it all up then? With pleasure, sir. relays are moved into the interior position, the polarity of the entire system will be inverted, destructively. Sounds messy. I like it. Those external junctions. My fry the suit, but I've got to close those relays. One relay connected, two remaining.
on the go. generator is going into the meltdown zone. Brody, move it or lose it. We still need to find the whip. Run the scan and... Wait, what are those victims? Brody, seriously. Route all power to your thrusters and hit go. I don't think there is a DeWitt anymore. Protean would be part of Ultimo now. So Tony, what are the chances that Ultimo isn't taking orders from AIM anymore? That it's entirely independent and completely homicidal? No way to know until after it kills me. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? That's what I'd do. Kill the one guy who can stop me. Especially since we just shut down his little lightning rod. I never managed to build it. Not even a prototype. Tony, what the hell is wrong with you? Planning how to use the damn planet to kill people? Because that's what your superiors paid me to do. Like I promised Jensen, I'm going to spend the rest of my life cleaning up the mess I made. Ultimo battle chassis detected. Approximate mass, 200,000 tons. Well, this is going to be one hell of a mess, T. Yeah, guess we pissed him off. So let's isolate it. Draw it to us and minimize collateral damage. Let it find us. You know, make it easy, but not too easy. That's the plan. Lead it back to the Stark Archives and shut it down. Jarvis, fire up the deep reactors at the Archives. Ultimo's hungry, so let's put out a bowl of milk. And if it doesn't work? Doesn't matter. We'll be dead. Please do not think that 
but I fail to recognize my creator. I'm flattered. As you created me, so shall I destroy you. I screwed up, okay? I made mistakes. Sick men, like DeWitt, took my mistake and warped you into something. Something monstrous. But you, you grew, you learned, you amazed us all. Don't make me have to kill you. You're my responsibility. Yes, you are responsible. And you must pay. Launch on my mark. Rhodey, ring his doorbell. You got it. Stormbreaker, let him have it. Tony, tell me you made it in. Tony. Well, you know, it worked. I'm in. You can take out those big arc reactors, I think we'll have a shot at this. Oh, I hate when you think instead of know. Me too. Good luck out there. All comm systems going dark while I learn what makes this thing tick. Copy that. Radio silence until you say different. Tell me Ultimo won't regrow these things. No promises, sir. But it does require power. He has less of that power. That's hopeful. Oh boy. Okay, okay. Let's keep moving.
Alright team, you got the ball. Rhodey, I love you. In a totally platonic fashion, of course. I don't know what you did, but it's working. Short-sighted as ever. This ends now. Hey, we agree on something. Rhodey, Tony, I'm making some progress. Yeehaw, I guess. Now, what the hell does that mean to me? It means he's closer to going down, for one. I've also learned more about how he works. You should be able to prevent some of his attacks as he powers them up. Um, sub-arc reactors will appear whenever he's about to it. Got it. Watch for the tells, shoot the sub-arcs, no getting hit. Right. One more thing. Blow up another couple of his main arc reactors, okay? This coding and generation draws a lot of power. And I need it to stop. On. I love you. In a totally platonic fashion, of course. I don't know what you did, but it's working. Short-sighted as ever. This ends now. Hey, we agree on something. Rhodey, Tony, I'm making some progress. Yeehaw, I guess. Now, what the hell does that mean to me? It means he's closer to going down for one. I've also learned more about how he works. You should be able to prevent some of his attacks as he powers them up. Um, sub-arc reactors will appear whenever he's got to attack. Got it. Watch for the tells, shoot the sub-arcs, no getting hit. Right, one more thing. Blow up another couple of his main arc reactors, okay? This protein regeneration draws a lot of power, and I need it to stop. On it. Got a present for you, wrapped up in a pretty box. Keep talking. Our engineers have reworked the tech recovered from the Malaysian op. We can call the perfect storm right on Ultimo's head on your mark. So mark already! Wait, abort that! Too late, Stark. We're firing it. What the? Fury, he's adapting. Ultimo did that. Pretty soon you'll have control over all your weapon systems. This present sucks. a massive power fluctuation inside that vent. That'd be me kicking him in a very sensitive spot. But he's healing again, so I need you to shut him down. I know the drill. Take out his arc reactor.
One more down. Keep going. I'm stuck in here until you take him out. Sensors indicate a power loss of 3%. We're ahead of projections. 3%? Yay us. Is Tony okay in there? The Cessnet isn't telling me anything. Mr. Stark knows what he's doing, sir. Rest assured, he has a plan. In other words, eyes front, Colonel. Last reactor is toast. You're good to go, Tom. You are a beautiful human being. Keep the line open. I'm gonna need one more favor from you in a minute. Uh, hey guys. What do you need, T? I need you to distract him a little. Did you say distract him? More than usual. Look, I'm sorry, he's repairing too fast. I need you to do a lot of damage all at once so he can't repair. We're sending in everything and the kitchen sink, Stark. Make it count. Copy that, sir. This is my mess and it's time to clean it up. Jarvis. I really don't know what's creepier. Did some of my oldest go by morphing in this crazy talk, or hearing your voice with the evil filter added? Most definitely the last one, sir. Constructs analyzed and counted. Combat solution complete. It's vulnerable to everything at your disposal. You may commence the beatdown itself. The exoskeleton is attempting to extract itself from its organic host, to its life signs are fading rapidly. Can we save him? No, sir. Biological scans show irreversible protein integration. I've got you, don't worry. Stark, we're dying here. T tell me, tell me about it. Life support systems at 6%. Tony, what are you doing? 
Winning! Tony, it's me, Pepper. Please don't hey, do Hey, Pep, bad time. Life support systems at 0.3%. Doc, you're going to kill you. Shut up. Tony! Bro Brody, I, I need you to listen. Wait, we thought you were dead. Still possible. I got him, but only for a little longer. What should I do? Shoot the bastard in the head. I sent a command code. Expose the Protean network. I'll buy you a few seconds. You know what happens next, right? You gonna get out of there? File under details. I'll be dead whether you take the shot or not. Booyah. Nikki, you ready? Copy the living hell out of that. Good, because you're up next. Try not to miss. Sir? Yeah? Will you promise me something? Sure. What's up? Never again. Never... The archives. My archives, sir. Could you please... You got it. At ease, everybody. We on? Good. Once upon a time, I didn't know how to save the world. Then I got smarter. No, no, it's not working. Once upon a time, I didn't know how to save the world. That was then. <sighs> Wait, okay, where? Once upon a... <sighs> I still don't know how to save the world. But I'm pretty good at guessing. <laughs>